Bird Flowers. See you on the inside. We're now entering red, white, and blue, guys. <laughs>
I got, came out with my wife something, so he said I came out with something, but it's not for me, it's for the wife. It's a plush from her, uh, for her theme, it's in her game room, Alice in Wonderland, and it's a surprise for y'all, so I'm gonna let y'all see the excitement on her face when she get it, y'all. Oh, that's if she get excited, y'all. Well, guys, I'm walking back to the car. Let's see if the wife gets uh, excited not about me this time it's about her so let's see if my wife gets excited she's moved the bags out of my seat so she got mcdonald's look at the beautiful children in the back y'all just to let you know what you have let his window down what you just went about it was god it like this, all right we're back it Cat, like this. i have a surprise for you it was nothing found for me in that Jones. Right. But I got a surprise for my wife. Now, I'm going to open up. Huh? I know I'm going to pull it out for you. Now, I want the people on my channel to see the, the shock on you. Let's see if you if you get shocked or excited. You ready? Five, four, three, two, one. Who was that? <laughs> Who was that? That's your shark. Yeah. I found my wife the plushie from her Alice in Wonderland theme for her game room. Let me touch it. And I can't touch it. <laughs> How's that, baby? Wonderful. Huh? Wonderful. Couldn't find me nothing in that mug, so it's all good. But at least she was excited. You excited, though? Yeah. Put it in the trunk. All right, guys. Hey, guys, I'm back with another video. This is an add on to what I found the day I went to that thrift store. I didn't find really nothing but the wife's uh, thing for her game room. Uh, but I also went other places. I went to the thrift store. And then I went to a mom and pop store, multi vest, multi vest. So I'm showing you what I picked up from the pawn, what well, the, the pawn shop, that is. I went to the pawn shop, my bad guys. And this is what I picked up from the pawn shop. Look at here, that now that's tight, y'all. Oh yeah, from the pawn shop. This is what I found from the pawn shop, guys, right here. So. Next, I found this from the pawn shop right here. Now, if I have another one of these, I'll be trading this off to get another video game, as you can see. Yeah, this is what I found at the pawn shop. And is it scratched? And no, it's in pretty good condition. It's Marvel versus Capcom 3. Next, Devil May Cry 5, I found. Devil May Cry 5. And here's the back. By Capcom. And bam, look at that. Let me show you the disc. The disc looks straight, really good. Okay, next I found FIFA Street. FIFA Street. For the PS3, FIFA Street. Here it is. Let me show y'all guys what the disc look like. Yeah, it's pretty good, yeah. FIFA Street. Next, I found Dragon Ball X. Well, 
for the PS4 guys. Whoa, yeah, for the PS4 guys. Look at that. Look at that. It's in the collection now, y'all. Let me open it up. Is it scratched? No, it's not scratched. It needs to be wiped off. So it's good. And this is my pawn shop pickup. Now next is what I picked up from the trip. The trip store. Got a couple of things I picked up from the thrift store and here's one. I can't wait to get into this game here. Look like it's a pretty good game. Mirror's Edge. Seems to be great. Front, the back. Got a disc in the manual. PS3 game. And it's clean. It's clean, y'all. That's the queen walking through, y'all. But it's good. Now I have a, a PSP game. Snowboarding. The PSP. Let me open it up. Hold on, that's not snowboarding. That's Casino Royale in here. The one they said that's Casino Royale in here, a movie. So I guess it's all good. I still have to get, if I got the case, I still got to get the game, but Casino Royale was in there. I wish I looked at that before I walked out with it. Next, this is what I got from Multivest. I got Shadow Man 2. Shadow Man 2 for the PS2. Look at that, Shadow Man 2. And uh, it's complete with the, with the, it's not complete with the manual. You don't have a manual. All right, this is cool. Look at that, it's nice and crisp. Shadow Man. That's what's up. Next, I have SmackDown, Just Bring It with my favorite homeboy, The Rock. Smackdown, just bring it. How about that, y'all? Smackdown, just bring it. And it's not complete because it doesn't have the manual. But let's see what the disc look like, guys. This is clean. Just bring it. And it's in the collection, y'all. Just bring it. There you go. Next, I have Ready to Rumble, Ready to Rumble 2 Boxing. Ready to Rumble 2 Boxing for the PS2. How about that? But that's complete with manual, y'all. That is complete with the manual. Let me see how the disc look. The disc looks clean, guys. The manual looks great. But yeah, Ready to Rumble 2 is the back. So that is it for what I got for the collection this week, guys. Thanks for watching Miami Gaming Retro and Beyond. And as always, you know what I'm saying, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And this is your boy Miami, and we're out like yo.